In a time when everyone is searching for a smile, the youngest residents of Verona provided them for those who may need it most. One by one, stopping by the Four Winds Manor assisted living facility with a piece of art or an inspiring message. As a mom, you always want to teach your kids um, valuable lessons, and I think this is a, a great time to, to teach our kids to reach out to your community and help out in any way possible. Mackenzie Clark Seltzner was inspired to bring joy to the elderly, so she rallied other Verona families to help with signs, smiles, and even you singing. Make me happy. Doing things like this today just puts smiles on their faces. We try to make it as normal as we can and keep them as healthy as we can. So this is this is great. Which proved to be a rewarding moment for the residents and their visitors. <laughs> what made it so much fun? And that I got to make people happy. To bring we wanted joy to people's hearts. Yeah, because we wanted to make people feel happy. As signs went up on the Four Winds Manor yard, chalk broke out down the street. Meet Lori Burgos and her son Robinson. For the second straight day, they went out to decorate the streets of Verona with messages of joy, love, and hope for those passing by. Because everything is important and you shouldn't appreciate everything you have and like be positive and have a good attitude about everything. In a time when the community needs it most, kids are stepping up to provide smiles to those they may never meet. And Caroline, what made it really special was as I was leaving Four Winds Manor, I came across Lori and Robinson. It just showed that everyone in the community, whether they know it or not, had the same mission, and they continue to do so to bring a smile to someone's face. And I know you said the people in here, they're getting to spend a little bit more time with the ones they love. That's right. Robinson pointed out that normally his mom is so busy with work that, of course, these past few weeks have been a whirlwind. He's enjoying the extra time he does get with his family. Well, really sweet story, George. Thanks so much. Thank you.